It is time for today's big game breakdown. Let's go to the NFL and talk about the Arizona Cardinals and the Minnesota Vikings. Before I break the game down, I do want to let you know about what's going on this weekend over at Wager Talk and SportsMemo.com. I am off to a real good start in football. Eight and three college football start, three and zero in the NFL last Sunday. The five percent big tickets, nine and two with the push since May. So running real good. You can get my complete card right now over at wagertalk or sportsmemo.com for the entire weekend, bargain priced. All right. We talk about overreactions to week one. We heard Rob Vino talk about week one is the overreaction week. Let's talk about underreactions too. Because when week one was exactly like the preseason, and the preseason was exactly like last year, better shouldn't necessarily underreact either. Okay, the Minnesota Vikings were hyped in August, certainly here in Las Vegas. There was a lot of support for the Vikings over the total. There are a lot of bettors who've made money with Mike Zimmer over the years in a variety of roles. There's residual love for Minnesota, and there was a lot of Minnesota over money. Minnesota, you know, it's Minnesota to win the division, Minnesota over their season win total, et cetera, et cetera. This was a mediocre team at best last year. Then they were a mediocre team in preseason, at best, in August. They were a mediocre team, at best, in week one. This is a Viking squad that completely remade their defense in the offseason. This isn't the elite stop unit that they were earlier in Mike Zimmer's tenure. Offensive line remains a problem, just like last year. Dalvin Cook can't find room to run. Kirk Cousins is under pressure. Okay. But the betting markets are saying, no, 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 last week was an aberration. Oh, forget the preseason. Oh, last year doesn't matter either. This Vikings team, I'm sure of it. They're good. Really. You know, Zimmer was good coach. I'm not buying it. All right. We've seen a year of the Vikings looking mediocre. We saw a preseason where the Vikings looked mediocre. We saw last week the Vikings were mediocre. I think this is a mediocre team. Arizona, not so much. They weren't healthy down the stretch last year. They looked healthy week one, explosive offensively. Cliff Kingsbury's third year on the job. Everybody knows the offense. Everybody knows what they want to do. Vance Joseph's defense blew up the line of scrimmage a week ago. Nothing fraudulent about the week one showing. And yet the betting market adjustments, very limited. Nothing but Minnesota money. Arizona minus three and a half is the only way I could look to bet this one. But I'll tell you, no rush. <laughs> There's been lots of wise guy money for Minnesota. Three and a half, the current line. I'm not convinced we'll see it, but I wouldn't be shocked. You're only laying three with Arizona before kickoff. So look to the home favorite in this one. Let's believe what we saw and not underreact, even though it's week one or week two. <laughs> there you have it, Craig. It's big game breakdown. Back to you, Michael.